nobody cared who I was until I put on the mask. It's been six months and 24 days since I found my true self. Nobody knew what Kermit the Frog meant to me. But when I found out he was a puppet, I realized the world needed Kermit. They needed me. Ever since Michael put the mask on, there's been a huge strain on our friendship. Uh, he no longer responds to Michael anymore. It's only Kermit now. He's even started calling me Fozzie Bear. I just wanted to stop. So, uh, are we watching the Muppets movie? Uh, yeah. I've even perfected the voice. I mean, I think I've always had it in me, but it just took a little push. Speaking of which, I always do karaoke with my friends and songs exclusively sung by Kermit the Frog. Why are there so many songs about rainbows? And what's on the other side? I don't really see why the mask is such a, a bad thing. He's, you know, he's killing it in karaoke night. Do you think this is affecting his mental health? Uh, honestly, no. Just, it's mainly about the karaoke and how good he's doing in it. So what are all these interviews about? You thought it would be like a cool action movie starring Kermit, which is me, but we haven't really filmed any action scenes or really any scenes at all. No, this is an intervention. You're trying to get you to take off the mask. Me? Me take off the... That's never going to happen! Get out of here! Stay down! Stay down! I think the mask is really starting to get to him. He's been a lot more aggressive lately and he's just started doing really stupid things now. Um, just yesterday, he locked himself in the bathroom for an entire day to test the true limits of his powers. Kermit, can you please come out? It's been a full day, you haven't eaten. No, I need you to concentrate to unleash the full potential of my power. Kermit, open up. I will never fall to you haters. Did you hear he started locking himself away in the bathroom? Um, no, but that's probably not the best thing. Um, maybe we should talk to him about it. What? Tyler wants me to take off the mask? Well, I guess I'll just take one more contact off my phone then. You can tell him to shove it! You guys don't understand what this mask means to me! Hey, I'm Mike's therapist. He is so far gone. He's already started to push his close ones further away, which is exactly what I've told him not to do. I've worked with criminals responsible for the most vile of crimes. I've worked with war veterans suffering for PTSD. I've worked with people that think it's a good idea to go to Taco Bell. But, Mike? Oh, Mike, he's, he's different. Yeah! <laughs> Capable of. Michael has always been a bit of a drama queen, but this is worse than usual. One time, um, he got into an argument at Walmart with a mother of five children over a Ken Barbie doll. That was a year ago. Alright, let's go look for him. As a frog, I naturally blend in with my environment. Now I must meditate. Got you now, stupid frog man. 
where'd you guys find me? You're sitting in the middle of the floor of your own house. Jake, you be a therapist. No, I can't go back. You'll never take me alive. So you don't seem that enthusiastic to be here. Your friends had to drag you in and all. But would you talk for a Scooby snack? Wrong franchise. Okay, fine. You guys got the mask off of me. I'll admit it, it's not easy being green. My roommate probably wants to move out and so I pushed away my best friend. It just felt so good being someone other than myself for just a little bit. I truly need help and I wish they can forgive me. So I worked out some of my minor shoes with my doctor and I'm happy to say I'm a new frog now. I mean man. Someday we'll find it, the rainbow connection, the lovers, the dreamers, and me. La da da dee da da doo.